Hey dancers, welcome back to our channel. I'm Julie and I'm the owner and one of the instructors here at Broche Ballet, a ballet school just for adults in Denver, Colorado. I am so glad that you're all having so much fun with our jumping series. If you haven't already taken a look at some of our videos so far, go take a look at our videos on safe jumping, faster petit allegro, and a little grand allegro combination to get started. So in our Grand Allegro combination, a lot of you had a question about how you switch directions in class. So sometimes you're doing a big Grand Allegro, and then you do this crazy thing over there in the corner, and all of a sudden you're going the other direction. This is often, there's a couple ways to do it, but the one we're gonna talk about today is called a contretemps. It looks like this. So let's break it down. I'm doing just tombe pas de barre, contre tom in that video. You can do it in any, uh, after anything in this, in grand allegro combinations usually, or even petit allegro, but just for simplicity, so we only have to think about one thing. I'm just doing something we all probably already know, which is tombe pas de barre, and then a contre tom, and then other way, and then other way, and then back and forth. So, I start with tombe pas de barre. I go tombe pas de barre back, side, front. I'm gonna find in a big fourth, kind of like if in Grand Allegro if I was gonna do a glissade after that. So I'm kind of in this big position. You can do a contretemps in this position anywhere. So I'm gonna swing my back leg around. I'm gonna push off and swing it around. That's almost like a little rond de jambe there. So I'm gonna swing it around. I'm gonna jump off of my standing foot, feet, and switch which foot I'm standing on. So let's do that again. So I did my tombe pas de bray, and I land in that big faille. I bring my back foot off the ground, so now my weight is all on my front foot. I bring it around, I jump and I hit it, and I land on that leg. The one that just ronde jambed is the one that I land on. Now my other leg is free, and I can tombe pas de bray the other direction into that faille. My new back leg pushes off and swings around. Feet land. So oh, you want to try to think about a little beat in the air. A beat means you hit your legs together. I want you to think about hitting your inner thighs together and not your feet. So we beat the tops of our legs together. So on that rond de jambe, back leg comes around. We're almost, I'm going to do it facing you, so we almost beat front. Beat front and then we land on it. So it's almost like a little switch. So if I started here, just so you can see it from the front view, I would go around beat switch. So that little beat is uh, makes it look super fancy and really fun and cute. If you don't get that beat in the beginning, that's okay. Just think about rond de jambe your back leg and then jump on it and free the other leg. So that simpler version without the beat is a rond de jambe land. Where the beat comes in handy is encouraging you to land underneath yourself. The common mistake with a contretemps is that we land over here and then our weight can't get us going the other direction. We really need to be able to go right underneath ourselves. So we go here and then we want to replace that foot. So if you're not doing that beat, make sure you really get this leg right underneath you as you bring your other leg out. So contretemps looks really fancy. You can get a little bit tangled, but remember that it switches feet and switches direction. So your back foot comes around and it's the one that you land on. Your back foot comes around, it's the one you land on. So you're changing direction, changing feet, changing leg, all that good stuff. All right, dancers, I hope this helps you figure out a contretemps and how to start putting it into combinations in class in a grand allegro or even a petit allegro. Until next time, dancers, have fun with the jumps. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. It really does help us out. Take care.